Finally, here tonight, we all know about the bullying kids can inflict on each other at school, and it can be brutal. And that's perhaps why this next story touched a lot of us. It all begins at a student-run business where they trade in the toughest commodity to come by in high school, and that's acceptance. We get the story tonight from NBC's Harry Smith. Good morning, how are you? Dunwoody High School is brimming with the usual clicks and chaos of adolescence. But then there's this. Back in the kitchen of a classroom for kids with special needs, it's prep time. Soon their coffee shop will open. Hi. And that means a flood of paying customers. Can I get a cheesy grits? Gus keeps the juice flowing. Hannah is a jack of all trades. You say you want coffee, sir? Prince is the greeter in chief. Here you go, sir. Thank you. What you won't hear in the coffee shop are barbs or taunts. Hoodie, 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 thank you. Principal Tom McFerrin says respect for others is a big thing here. It just make some good people, and that's what we're all about here, is just be good people and, and, and do good things in this world. And maybe that's why when Dunwoody students voted for homecoming court this year, among the 10 boys and 10 girls stood Gus Ashbury, and Hannah Keen. But this gets better. Just watch. This year's winner is Miss Hannah <laughs> Mr. Cuss. Gus and Hannah's classmates voted them king and queen of the homecoming court. For Dunwoody High, it was a symbol of pride. And back at the coffee shop this week, Gus and Hannah were still glowing. What happened? I'm nervous. You were nervous? Excitement. Exciting. Seems the whole school was pulling for them. It's big, it's huge. And that's more than respect, it's acceptance. Harry Smith, NBC News, Dunwoody, Georgia.